everyone, I'm Juliana. Um, I'm doing the Talos Principle today by myself. Um, so we're still in area six, and last time I realized I didn't solve this this puzzle, but mm, while editing, the solution came to me. Uh, so we'll be headed back to do that one. Um, so, ah, uh, yes, deception. <clears throat> it really is a deception. It's annoying. Um, so I have to do all of this again. Joyous bull hockey. Um, <clears throat> I also noticed, like, don't get me wrong, I did notice that I missed, like, a QR code. But that will have to be dealt with later. Yes. Alright, so, where are you? You are up here. what this might look like, I don't need to open it. No, I don't. I don't at all. So, um, I'm gonna put this one like here, I think. And you are gonna need to There we go. Alright. There is a there is a purpose for this. Um Alright, so Oh crap. Okay. I've gotta go and I can't cross the stream. Okay, hold on. We're gonna get here in just a second. Um... So I kept that as tight as I could. But... Maybe what I need to do... <clears throat> didn't cross the things. Woo! I figured it out. Whee! There's that one. <clears throat> yep. So that was, that was that one um, that I figured out. I still haven't figured out this one over here, but the QR code that I missed was right this way. I probably should have got it when I started, but... I was more interested in other things. Uh, there's a serpent in the machine, a creature of lies and blasphemies, but blasphemy, uh, perverted by the archive that knows no hope and would 
and would plunge the world into eternal darkness to glorify its own despair. I have sworn an oath never to allow it into my heart when with faith be 10.1.100. <clears throat> so, yeah. I know what it's talking about. Um, Alright, I think I'm going to go back and try and do other things in other places so that we can actually progress in the story. <clears throat> Looting library session done. Uh, mounting local disc, 90, or 47 million. Distributed resources found. Connecting to network drives, error network, and a successful library. Archive session ready. List. Searching for locally cached resources. Uh, lit underscore arch 1912 CE Athena 9.txt web crawl 9995 slash 10 slash 11 singularity discussion 104 HTML loc 999 slash 03 slash 13 AMA HTML. Uh, let's go with Athena. She examined the symbol on the fragment she found in the buried city. Again, an owl. What could its significance be? It seemed as if they had been scattered about in the labyrinth by some unseen hand for a purpose that yet eluded slash slash slash. Most likely, the owl was the sigil of the author of these words, which had so error error again a nebulous memory as if from a previous life the owl was the symbol of error more error and the goddess error 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 that might actually be hex but it's looking like an error um outside under the moon or perhaps on the city walls with the wind rose but there was no time to contemplate this further now for a the automatons had seen her and their mechanical arms extended towards error the fragment and ran their beams converging on error singularity underscore discussion 104 articles the singularity is coming comment 104 user alex 16 reply report you know, the more I think about it, the more I believe that no one is actually worried about the AIs taking over the world or anything like that, no matter what they say. What they're really worried about is that someone might prove once and for all that consciousness can arise from matter, and I kind of understand why they find it so terrifying. If we can create sentient beings, where does that leave the soul? Without mystery, how can we see ourselves as anything other than machines? And if we are machines, what hope do we have that death is not the end? What really scares people is not that artificial intelligence in the computer, but the natural intelligence they see in the mirror. Show next comments. Close. AMA.html Nadia Sarabi AMA. As one of the founders of the modern science of pneumatics, many credit you with inventing the term itself. How do you see the state of science today? Sorry, I said science twice. Uh, Nadia Sarabi. Mixed. On the one hand, the existence of the Institute for Applied Pneumatics and a couple of similar organizations is highly encouraging. On the other hand, the degree to which science is seen as Serving purely military or corporate causes is, in my opinion, stopping us from exploring many important avenues of research. In a sense, it's people like Alexander Drennan who are the real pioneers today, who have the enthusiasm and dedication that the system as a whole seems to be lacking. Do you think technology poses a danger to humanity? Nadia Sarabi, no. Technology is just a tool. What we do with it is up to us. Uh, the Extended Life Project Plan, crazy or visionary? Both. Um, <clears throat> Arkady um, Cherenskiev. Cherenskiev. I'm really sorry I butchered that. I really am. Um, 
crazy or visionary uh, smiley face, Nadia Sarabi, both are Katie, is that you do error to Alan Jameson subject uh, reply scenario Jen. Uh, so far as as the puzzles are solvable and the complexity within ne the necessary parameters. Uh, Alexandra had some more tweaks she wanted to suggest, but I think we're heading in the right direction here. Interesting. <clears throat> so it sounds like uh, one of our uh, one of our main um, narrators, I'll say. Um, is is it uh, the one leading this project so these spaces make no sense i walk into a dead end and materialize in the garden one is day the other is night the space is not real james too because one was taken b 99.1.0193 <clears throat> okay, so many places to go here. Um, let's see what we got. Um, that's the red one. It's going to be hard. Let's give it a shot. Windows into a labyrinth. quite see down to the end of that corridor, but that's where it needs to go. Alright. You come with me. Oh, darn it. Like I'm missing something. Like I need like at least one more of those, probably two.
Hold on, guys. One moment. so long. It's just kind of a hard thing to get right. Whee! I got it. <sighs> Thank you, sweetie. Um. Alrighty, so... See if I can get another one. Two pesky little buzzers. Sorry guys, I'm trying to hit make this the easy way and it's not the easy way. Okay, so it does need to be just like a hair closer. like the blue freaking thing because I don't see the blue freaking thing. I don't see a blue source nowhere. But you're gonna go there because somehow I think I'm gonna have to come back to you. Anyway. Alright. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know if I'm doing it wrong in the comments below. Um, and I'll see you next time. Bye!